Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm diving deep into the latest firmware update for the DJI Osmo Pocket 3. DJI has rolled out some amazing new features and optimizations that you'll definitely want to, want to check out. Let's start. First up, the brand new feature that many of you, like myself, will appreciate, cancel recording. Ever started recording and immediately realized you don't want to? Now, by pressing and holding on the shutter record button, you can cancel the recording. This won't just stop recording. It, it will ensure that the footage isn't stored, saving you precious storage space. However, do keep in mind that this function doesn't work in motion lapse, time lapse, or webcam mode. But for regular v video mode, it's a game changer. Before you would have to go into the preview and delete your videos there, but now it's made much easier. Next, there's a fantastic update for those of you using the DJI Mic 2 the auto power off function. This is a great battery saving feature. Just make sure that your, your, your DJI Mic 2 firmware is updated to the latest version that I have on the bottom of the screen. I will leave a link in the description. Now to update the DJI Mic 2, I, I assume that as long as your mic is connected to the DJI uh, Osmo Pocket 3, when you do the update, that it will automatically update the mic too. But that is not how it's done. Uh, again, the link, the link will be in the description where you can download the firmware and so after you get the firmware you want to plug your DJI Mic 2 into uh, your computer or even an Android phone I'm not sure about iOS once you once you have connected it you you take that that firmware file and place it on the root of the storage the built-in storage of the DJI Mic 2 you just unplug it you turn it on you'll see the, the it will come on with the blue light then it'll flash red and I would say give it like 10 seconds and then you could uh, if uh, you can then go ahead and uh, I will say turn it off and then turn it back on and you should see that new option inside of the DJI um, uh, the DJI Osmo Pocket 3 under the wireless microphone option you should see the auto power off function now I do want to warn you that if you you, it only works when it's connected uh, to the Osmo Pocket 3. If you have your DJI Mic 2, like I'm using it right now with my with my smartphone, then it wouldn't auto power off. Actually, last night I actually forgot it uh, to turn it off while it was connected to my smartphone, and it just stayed connected uh, the entire night. But it still had about 90% battery, I think, or somewhere around in the 90-ish. So it didn't really drop that much the, the the battery life on the dji mic 2 is very very good dji also optimized the recording gain and volume performance of the dji mic 2 ensuring your audio is always top notch selfie mode gets an update too with an optimized 5d joystick control now the panning direction matches the joystick movement making your shots more intuitive and seamless which before you would uh, when you're in selfie mode and you pan to the to the right on the joystick it will actually go uh, inverted and it will just pan left and that's go go and that's the same for panning left up or down it will usually go in the opposite direction now with the update where wherever you're panning uh, it, it will go in in that same direction which is something I think should have been in here from day one Excellent transfer files or OTG connection mode, the gimbal's recovery logic has been optimized, ensuring smoother transition back to shooting mode. For live streamers out there, you'll be happy to know that the DJI Mic 2 transmitter performance and connection stability during live stream has been significantly improved. And of course, DJI has squashed some minor bugs to enhance your overall experience with the Osmo Pocket 3. There you have it folks, the latest updates and features for the DJI Osmo Pocket 3. Whether you're vlogging, creating content, or just capturing life's moments, these updates are designed to make your experience even better. Remember to update your device to take advantage of all these new features. If you find this video helpful, give it a thumbs up, don't forget to subscribe, and if you have any questions, leave a comment down below. Until next time, I'm your starter in tech. Peace. Out. I gotta press the button.